This is a Game Caviar production. I don't know why they changed the name of this uh, level, whatever, the board, map, whatever you want to call it. They changed the name of it. I started off with a shotgun and pissed me off. I switched to another weapon. That weapon pissed me off. I switched to another weapon. I don't care. I haven't played this game in so long. Stupid grenades don't activate immediately. I don't like that. Now, this was dumb. I shouldn't have did that. Whatever. I should have did some MLG Pro, jump in the air, dolphin dive, lay on the ground, roll around, hokey pokey, whatever. However the damn song goes, but I didn't. So, whatever. I'm playing hard point, my favorite game mode. I hope they carried it over or carry it over into Call of Duty Ghosts, which is supposed to be amazing. Going to see it next week when Microsoft reveals Xbox Infinity uh, 720 or uh, Durango, whatever the hell they call it. Microsoft is going to treat Call of Duty Ghost like it's an exclusive, like they always do. I don't care. I'll probably end up getting a new Xbox. So what? That guy got caught slipping. This is a horrible match, by the way. Do not judge my pedigree of Call of Duty by this one match. Although this game is absolutely, positively a piece of junk, I do like this match. Fire and Rangers, uh, if it wasn't my favorite match in... Black Ops, it was definitely one of the best, one of my, one of my favorite maps. I liked it. I liked it better than I like Nuketown. Hell, I don't care what you think. I'm saying it. I did. I got caught slipping right there. That guy was in the most, look at that, the most inconspicuous position ever in a video game. I swear, I did not even, it looked like bullets, it looked like bullets were just coming out of nowhere. I was like, what the hell is that? What's going on here? I don't know how this guy managed to kill me. I mean... Hell, I was clearly shooting first. The lag in this game is just disrespectful. It is deplorable. It is like the worst situation that you can ever have in a video game. My internet connection isn't bad. I have good internet connection. I have a dedicated line set up just for my internet. Uh, that is not... I don't know where that guy came from. He just probably just spawned there. I have a dedicated line set up that is not shared with... Well, it's shared with a TV, but, you know, the signal is still good. And... The reason why I did that is because of video games, okay? Like, it's not at all. When I had direct TV, I couldn't get DSL in my area because the local cable provider, Cox, Cox Cable, is all about giving you the Cox. And that's exactly what they did to other companies because you can't get a DSL in my area. So I had to get a line just for cable while I had direct TV. Funny thing about direct TV is that they're awesome, but they're also very expensive. Too expensive for my taste, so I ended up getting rid of them, and I went back to Cox. And that's what I have now. I know you don't care about the little tidbit of my life, but I felt as though I needed to just splay it out for you, and that's what I did. I was gone for a little while. I went on vacation. As you could say, I went on vacation. My wife actually graduated from college. Congratulations to her. She's a graduate. I should be graduating next year. Not trying to one-up on her. I'm just letting you guys know that I, I, I'm going to be a college grad too. Just not yet. So, while I was uh, away from the Game Caviar Studios and everything Game Caviar, I was just having a good time, man. You know, uh, we drove and that drive was really long. So, I stopped. Let me let me tell you something about Hardy's coffee. Don't ever buy coffee from Hardy's. I know what you're saying, like, well, what the hell are you doing buying coffee from Hardy's, dude? You're an idiot. It wasn't my idea. My wife was driving at the time, and she's all like, I went Hardy's for breakfast. Not Burger King, not McDonald's, not any other damn place on the planet that was in our vicinity that served breakfast. No, she went to Hardy's. Okay, whatever. I was like, look. You're going to get some coffee from Hardee's? Fine. I'm going to get some coffee from Hardee's. I'm going to get black coffee. And she's like, ooh, black coffee is nasty. And I'm like, that's not nasty. I'm a man. I'll drink it right in front of you. And I did. I don't even think I got halfway through that cup. Listen, this is the timeline. We got Hardee's breakfast. And getting to Hardee's was an adventure. By so I'll get into that in a minute. This video was long enough. But anyway, what happened was I had the, I, we finally made it to Hardee's. Everybody got food. I didn't get any food because I wasn't hungry. I went inside. I got a black coffee. Black coffee. Nothing was in this coffee but coffee, okay? It couldn't be any more truer than coffee than what I had. I started drinking it, and I drank like a, a quarter of the cup. We are down the highway. We went from Hardee's, and it wasn't even like 30 minutes later. I was within the confines of a McDonald's stall, absolutely pooping my brains out. 
it was not pretty all right i don't know whether you have or have not had the displeasure of using a public restroom for number two for guys or girls or whatever but it's not something that i would put in my memoirs if i ever write some memoirs okay it wasn't good man and I use the handicap stall, which I know has more room and it's awesome and you can move around and stretch out and do whatever you need to do. But if, to me, I'm not the type of person that, that chooses to go to the handicap stall. That's like a last... What if somebody that's handicapped needs to use the stall while you're in there? I mean, you feel like the world's biggest dick because you're sitting there using up all that damn space, handicap space, as an able-bodied individual. Some people don't care. I do. It had to have been at least 100 people coming in and out of that bathroom, man. Somebody was trying to get in. The door was locked, thank God, because I was in there just letting loose, going to war with the toilet. Why anybody would ever want to jump in or try to get in that is beyond me because I was not quiet with my defecation. It was not a solid one. Anyway, uh, while I was away back at home, I, I, I just hung out, you know, I started, I, I ate whatever I want, man. You know, you gotta just let loose on vacation. That's why it's a vacation, you know? You have to let loose. And that's exactly what I did. When I'm here and doing my normal everyday life, I honestly try to eat healthy, but you know, I didn't when I was back at home because like I said, it's a vacation. Why the hell wouldn't you wanna let loose and hang out and do whatever you want. I went to Starbucks and I paid $5 for a black coffee. I did. Okay, it wasn't quite $5. I'm not gonna lie on Starbucks like that, but it was way more than what I thought black coffee was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like a dollar. You know, you go to Starbucks and here's the thing about Starbucks. And I don't have any problem with Starbucks. That black coffee is expensive for my expectations but it was the best black coffee i've had and you know i went to many other places but here's the thing about starbucks people go in there and they act, they drink and they order all these weird named coffees and whatever and here i am just want a black coffee when i said i just want a black coffee it was like I admitted to smacking Jesus in the face. It was like, what do you mean? You just want a black coffee? That's it? You don't want anything? Okay, whatever. All right, Here, here's how much you owe. And it was like almost $3. I was like, Ugh, damn it. And I ordered a medium, which isn't really a medium in Starbucks. It's something else. You just, you just can't go in there and be like, let me get a medium. They're like, oh, it's, it's this. It's some sort of weird Latin name that I don't know because I'm a damn American. I don't have anything against Latin people or the Latin language. I, I like it. It's cool. I would learn it if I had enough time to dedicate my, my learning abilities to it. But if I say medium... I want medium. If I go to Starbucks and I want a medium drink, that's what I expect to see on the damn menu. Not some sort of weird name that I don't, that I'm unfamiliar with. Anyway, that's just a story time. I'll have another one, whatever, ramble. This max suck. This game is horrible. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studios, and I am definitely out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.